Good day, folks. Good day. Good day. I hope this message finds you well. I'm doing great out in nature, grounding as usual. So, in this video, we're talking about how the narcissist uses the new supply to get under your skin. Okay? Again how the narcissist uses the new supply to get under your skin all right if you've been discarded recently huh? the narcissist has moved on with the new supply then this one is for you okay so let's go over some of the things they may do or some of the ways they may act to get under your skin all right you know, like I said, if you've been discarded recently uh, and the narcissist has quickly moved on with your new supply, let's understand something. All right, chances are they had that supply on the hook the entire time they were with you, okay? While they were still with you, they had that supply on the hook anyway, okay? So it's nothing new, all right? But let's understand this, okay? If you were wondering if the new supply is better than you, then no, they're not. Okay, let me flat out say that. The new supply is not better than you. Okay? And let's understand this, all right? The narcissist is an individual okay, who is always in need of constant supply. Okay, whether it's financial supply, whether it's time, whether it's attention, whether it's admiration, whether it's, it's being spoiled, whatever, okay? But the narcissist is an individual who is in need of constant supply, okay? So this is the reason why they didn't even take time to heal. They didn't even give it time. They moved right on with another supply, okay? They moved on with someone else. As we know, the narcissist sees others as a um, not as equal individuals like themselves, but a means to an end, so to speak. Okay, as a, a tool for a job. Uh, individuals are there to, to serve a specific purpose, and once that purpose is finished, uh, when that purpose is is fulfilled, or when that purpose cannot be fulfilled, then they'll move on. There's no build in with that individual they just move on to find new supply okay so let's understand that the narcissist is in need of constant supply so when they discarded you chances are you wasn't providing them the supply that they needed from you okay and so they discarded you and then moved on quickly to find new supply all right now with this new supply now, okay, as we know, they'll go through the love bombing phase, they'll go through the trauma bond and all of that, okay? So what you're seeing or what you may be seeing, okay, is that the narcissist is putting on the show, okay, putting on the front, okay? They're building this whole image with the new supply to get under your skin, to make you jealous, to make you feel bad about yourself, okay? And so, if you are still connected on social media, which I would suggest you don't, okay? Post this card, I suggest you stay in no contact, all right? But if you still are connected on social media, you may start seeing them, all right, together with the new supply, okay? They may start posting pictures, they may start showing off activities that they're doing. They may start showing off gifts that they've received or that they're receiving. They may show off trips that they've taken, uh, vacations or whatever. Chances are they, they're putting on this whole big image. They're building this whole big image, right? They're putting on this big front about how the new supply is better, about how the grass is greener on the other side, guys. But chances are it's not. Okay, chances are it's not. Okay, and it's just a another image that the narcissist is, is building up. Okay, 
and they intend to use that to make you feel bad about yourself. They intend to use that to get under your skin some more. Okay, they intend to use that to throw salt in your wounds. They intend to use that to add insult to your range. Okay, so if you are wondering if the new supply is better than you, then chances are they're not. Okay, chances are they're not. Okay, this is just another love bomb phase. Okay, another honeymoon phase, guys. Okay, and it's only a matter of time before that new supply catches on to who the narcissist is and everything falls apart, okay? In a previous video, I mentioned if you call them three months from now, from that point and ask them how they're doing, guys, chances are you're gonna hear a totally different story, okay? I don't suggest that you do this, all right? I suggest that you stay in no contact, but should you ever do that guys you're gonna hear a totally different story okay so the new supply is not better than you guys all right it's just another one of those mental games that the narcissist plays okay they'll create this whole big image all right of how they're doing better than you all right they'll create this whole big image about how their new supply is better than you essentially to make you feel bad about yourself all right to make you feel like you was you was the one lacking in the relationship, but chances are you wasn't, okay? Chances are you wasn't, all right? But now that they've moved on, guys, they're gonna do this to get under your skin, all right? So let's know that, all right? The new supply is not better than you, okay? They're being love bombed, they're being trauma bonded, all right? And it's just a matter of time before they realize what's really happening, okay? Before they realize who the narcissist is and refuse to play alone, okay? So chances are that right there is gonna blow up, okay? The narcissist is gonna be disappointed, all right? And chances are that new supply is a downgrade from you because you're probably the best thing that ever happened to you, right? So if you were Wondering if that new supply is better than you or any of that, huh? If that narcissist is showing off, posting pictures of them together partying or taking trips or showing off gifts that they're getting each other and all of that, guys, it's just to get under your skin, okay? All of that will fade within a short period, okay? Like I said, if you were to reach back out to them in three months and ask about that, how they're doing, They'll, they'll tell you a totally different story, okay? So chances are, guys, the new supply is not better than you. The grass is not greener on the other side, all right? So get that out of your head and stay in no contact, okay? Stop watching your, your, your social media. Stay in no contact and focus on healing yourself, okay? Because the best has yet to come for you, okay? Focus on healing yourself. Focus on creating your new life. Because why? The best has yet to come for you. The narcissist is portraying this whole thing, okay, this whole image about things being better for them now, all right? But chances are it's not, and it's only a matter of time before they come crawling back to you, trying to hoover you back, and all of that, all right? So focus on yourself, guys, and ignore all of that. All right. As I mentioned earlier, guys, the, the narcissist is, a, is an individual who is in need of constant supply. Okay, they're in need of constant supply, and you could tell this by how fast they moved on after the relationship. Okay, any healthy individual after a relationship will take some time to heal, heal themselves. Okay, because they don't want the next relationship that they go in to end up the same way. Okay, so. Any healthy individual after a, a relationship will take some time to get better, to heal themselves, see what went wrong, and how to rectify it in their future relationships, okay? But you could see how fast a narcissist will move on, guys. This will tell you how unhealthy they are, okay? And it's also gonna confirm for you how they are in need of constant supply, okay? And so, they see you as supply, guys. We know this, okay? They see you as supply, all right? 
and they see you as a tool for a job essentially okay and a means to an end okay so when that supply is no longer coming in huh? when they feel like they're no longer receiving the same supply from you okay that that they used to receive guys they will move on and discard you so if you are in this position guy be prepared to be hoovered okay be prepared to be hoovered now i'm not saying when the hoover attempt comes to go and jump and go with it all right know that you the narcissist will come crawling back to you at some point all right but by then you should have already moved on gotten your, your life together okay there's no going back with the narcissist and like i said you you were there to to provide them supply okay and so the minute that supply slowed down or stopped coming in guys huh and the supply could be anything okay it could be housing it could be finances it could be food it could be attention it could be time it could be the sex it could be a lot of things okay with admiration compliments whatever it was that you was giving them that that motivated them okay when that stops guys so too do they okay that's how narcissists are let's understand that all right they're all about supply and when that supply ceases they too will cease all right and so this new supply that they have that they're using okay they're gonna and and sometimes the and narcissists are so dirty guys in their dealings that sometimes they they will pay someone or ask some find someone and ask them to pretend to be their new supply okay to pretend to be your new romantic partner all to get under your skin okay all to make you jealous all right this is how narcissists play all right narcissists dirty tricks that they play okay when you're no longer providing them that supply guys it's time for them to discard you and move on to find new supply there's no building with you there's none of that okay they deserve grade a supply and when you're not providing grade a supply they will go out and seek that okay so let's understand that you're not the problem all right the narcissist just has problems that new supply is just there to do the same thing that the narcissist did to you okay to provide them supply okay when they stop providing that supply the narcissist will discard them the same way they discarded you all right and so they're just there to provide supply huh? they're there to fill a void essentially okay and it's only a matter of time before that whole new situation or relationship comes crumbling down all right so as i said be prepared to be hoovered at some point all right i'm not saying when the hoover attempt comes to to go and go get with him all right because the narcissist is not going to change okay the narcissist is not going to change and let me tell you this if you ever go back to a narcissist they are, they will accept that okay as you approving of their relate of the way they treat you okay again if you ever go back to a narcissist they will accept that as you approving of the way they treat you so chances are they may even increase the abuse all right so i hope i made it clear enough guys the grass is not green on the other side the new supply is not better than you okay and the narcissist is doing all of this creating this whole image to get under your skin all right so let's understand that all right let's understand that the narcissist is all about supply all right and that new supply is there to fill that void okay it's there to fill that purpose to provide them supply so they're not better than you guys all right the narcissist is just using them the way they use everybody else okay the narcissist sees people as a means to an end all right a tool for a job essentially okay so they're not better than you all right and the grass is not green on the other side and it's a matter of time before that whole thing comes from with that all right so let me keep this one short guys until next time peace love and more life